Okay, I stuck a moment without the kids to do this for you. I'm going to show you a principle called aliasing. Aliasing is when your sample rate of your measuring device is not fast enough to actually catch the true frequency of what's happening, so you can get a false reading. So here there's a string, and we can turn this string on so that it rotates. We've got a rotating wheel here. And here we have a stroboscope invented by Dr. Edgerton. So we will turn the stroboscope until you can actually stop the rotation of this string. So, so here it looks like the string is rotating at about one hertz or maybe more like half a hertz. But in actuality, it's rotating much, much faster than that. Uh, something like 40 or 50. So the sample rate of the stroboscope or the time at which you're taking a measurement is not fast enough to get the true value. There you go. So here the sample rate appears to be very, very, or the, uh, the measured value it seems to be very, very low. Yep, that's it. So once we turn up our our measurement frequency you can see that it starts to become more apparent that it's rotating and you can actually get another false measurement here looks like there's several strings which is not the case so all right that's it daddy's had his science fun now I gotta go find the kids okay they're studying rotational inertia You want to make some slime? I want to go and get some slime. Slime.